In addition to your mid-cycle flush and your pre-harvest flush, we also have some enzyme products that are designed to help break down dead root mass as well as organic matter in your soil. Here at Monster Gardens, we're, we recommend using enzymes once a week and then using them on every single reservoir change or nutrient change as a pre-flush through the flush period at the end of harvest. Especially if you're reusing your medium or if you're the type of person that uses raised beds or just simply likes to re-till their soil, it's important to use enzymes at the end of the season or at the end of your grow cycle. So that way it allows for those dead roots to break down. It's very easy to just pull a root ball out of your, root, out of your soil. However, you're still gonna need those little strands of the roots to be broken down with the help of enzymes. So as far as these enzyme products, there's a few of them out here that you might recognize and maybe a couple that you don't quite recognize as being overly popular. However, it doesn't mean that Monster Gardens does not recommend them as being the best. So to start over here is probably one of the more common ones would be the Multi-Zen from House and Garden. This is a very popular enzyme product, especially for the hydroponic industry. It is known to be a very thin, smooth running. Next, we also have the BioCozyme, which is done by Grow More, and it seemed to be our favorite here at Monster Gardens. They do all their bacillus fermentations in-house, as well as putting batch dates and giving you a detailed fact sheet on all their products, especially this BioCozyme, which is important with enzymes because you want to know exactly what you're putting in your root zone and know that it's going to work every time you use it. Now, this one right here is probably one of the most popular in the industry product is there's nothing unique about, about it at all. It's just extremely expensive. They make a lot of different claims that isn't any bit unique over the other enzymes. However, you're gonna be paying about three to four times as much for the MSRP price. Lastly, we have the Green Planet Zyme. And this one's an extremely unique one because it's capsulated. So it's actually gonna have the longest shelf life. And the other thing to know about this product is yes, it does have a longer shelf life, but because you're not paying for the water that's added to it to dilute it down, it is more expensive up front, but it will last you a long time. The BioCozyme is definitely the best priced enzyme, especially because it has a lower application rate and a lower price from the get-go. So in the long run and in the short run, this will be the best thing for your buck. So you might be asking yourself, what do enzymes exactly do for the plants? What they mostly do is break down, whether it's root mass or organic matter. Most people are using these enzymes for breaking down dead root mass. So as you might know, in say a rock wool cube or a smaller, a smaller medium, you have a, a limited area where your roots can be. So those roots will eventually die off and make room for new roots. However, what you're gonna need is an enzyme to break those roots down, make, make it into a plant available food, as well as make more room for the new root growth. As well as breaking down dead root matter, it also is gonna break down organic food. So a lot, of people, a lot of times people use top dressings or amend your soil with organic matter, which is great. However, you need an enzyme to make it more available to the plants. Naturally occurring are enzymes in the native soils, so they're gonna, over time, break this, break this material down and make it available to the plants. However, you can speed that process up and make yourself, especially for the indoor type of grower, it's gonna really speed this process up and make that food available immediately. You can buy all of these products and many more at monstergardens.com. Use the link below this screen.